Huh? Damn it, Chris! Stop doing that! I Yo guys, what is up? It's P from PTV and welcome back to the Resident Evil 8 Village series, man. Uh, we should be nearing the end. I think this is episode like 967, something something near that. Uh, but we're in the warehouse over with our boy and, uh, and yeah, things are getting kind of iffy. If you guys are enjoying it, man, up to this point, please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. It helps it out so, so much as a small channel. You know, YouTube doesn't think guys belong on my stuff. So the more that you guys engage, whether it's a comment, like, or a subscription, the more people that YouTube sends it out to. So doing that, I would be really, really grateful for. And, uh, and yeah, that said, let's, uh, let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, so we just got done uh, in the last episode messing with my man Duke over here, getting some of these fire upgrades. Uh, if I remember correctly, we were supposed to head over to this ladder and see what else is in store. Let me see exactly. Escape the factory is still the mission, it's sort of like broad in general. So, not quite sure what's left in store. Ethan seems to think that there's a lot more of the game left. <laughs> I guess we'll see, buddy. I mean, we've been through a lot already. I mean, the playthrough to me has been like... I know that you guys see like edited versions of uh, gameplay from the episodes averaging about 40 minutes or so. Um, and there's 10 of them, right? So that would put actual gameplay of me somewhere around uh, 10 to 11 hours of un unedited gameplay. Miranda so. thinks we're nothing but children. Oh, she doesn't care for us? No. She's long lost all her humanity. Duh! Destroy her. Is this guy? Oh, oh shit. he is Watch gonna notice me. Drama. Die, please. Man, just like that. Chem fluid. Right. Okay, we've got a lot of sniper bullets, so that might kind of be the move. I know it's like not ideal, especially in this. I don't know which direction to go. We're just gonna go this way. What has he got a mining for? I wonder. Wow. Unaffected. Four shotgun bullets. Okay. We got a pipe bomb. Two pipe bombs. Some metal scrap. That's pretty clutch. Uh, some gunpowder. That's clutch as well. Nothing to craft, so we keep moving. Let's see, down this way. That was just a resource dump, apparently. It's always tricky, like... Here we go. Hey, one shot with the sniper. Clutch. Gotta get those headshots if we want one shots, though. A little shoulder bit right there. It's good enough, I guess. Dang it. Come on, baby. Ugh. All right. I think the sniper might be the way to go with these guys for now. It's what we got, and it's hitting pretty hard. Love to see that. What do we get here? Large crystal. Yes, sir. Gunpowder. What's in here? A lock pick. Can I pick it up? Thank you. Alright, we're gonna crawl through this wonderful looking ventilation system. That's so great. Alright. Big jump down. No ladder needed. Ladders are for chumps. Non-athletic folks. Okay, let's use a pipe bomb right here. Right? We should be able to. We can get through uh get through this little bit here. Yes, sir. Very good. Let's get some of these juicy resources. Quartz, crystal. Oh my gosh, man. Those are going to sell for quite a bit. Thank God for my 200 IQ big brain for the wall blow up. Feels great. Feels good. Feels real good. Okie dokie. A little hesitant on anything involving fans at the moment, considering the fan monsters out and about. Little bits of scrap falling. That ain't good. I don't know if we're really gonna get jump scared by anything in this episode. This, I mean, don't get me wrong. The warehouse, factory, whatever you want to call this, that's a lot of extra sniper bullets. 
it's it's unnerving for sure and it is slightly anxiety provoking but it just doesn't feel as scary as some of the other environments in the game i freaking knew it what Another the one? heck what the actual bro man with the longest reloads oh my gosh what am I supposed to do here? Okay, let's equip some more of these pipe bombs. I do have some explosive bullets as well. Oh, why? Oh, man. No, thank you. Oh, go, go somewhere. Sheesh. Okay, I don't really know what to do. These are like actual Terminators, though. My man Heisenberg with the actual Terminators. Come on, man. That's got to be enough. Okay, let's bust this guy out. Eat shit, bud. Is he? Did I break him? Is he glitched? No. I think I accidentally unglitched him right there. Okay, cool. One of them down. That's a thing. Come on. We don't have much more room here. Get behind this wall. Ah! Bastard! Me too. Did I miss? I actually hit the wall, didn't I? I I'm trying to move, man. I don't know if there's a way to avoid that, aside from just running, bro. What a hit that was. Another. Yes. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh, man. Like, what the heck, Resident Evil, we think? These crystal hearts. We're really under the impression that Terminator zombies are the are the move here? I oh, mean, Heisenberg's on some weird shit, dude. I don't know what he's up to. I don't know why he thinks that's fantastic. It's definitely not. My hair's doing some wild stuff today, guys. I just looked over and saw what I look like. That ain't good. Oh, well, I don't know if I'm going to be able to fix that. It is what it is. I know I got this weird, like, Jimmy Neutron thing going. Shout out to old school Nickelodeon. All right, lots of things falling around. I imagine we're going to be getting several more of those. It's not a great feeling, but um, let's go ahead and heal it up. Dude, look at my hand. It's so jacked. Um, oh, we can't craft anything, dude. This pipe bomb, maybe, right? It's a hard maybe for a pipe bomb. I need some health. I need the healths. I mean, I've just been taking, like, spinning blades straight to the gut, so I need some more of that magic juice. Alright. A herb. Right? Yes. Okay, more magic juice incoming. Love it. I gotta stop it somehow. How, dude? Oh, these things. I see. I'm just gonna use the pistol. Oh, man. Come over here. What did you... What did you guys think... Uh, been thinking about the puzzles that's one thing about the resident evil games like you always know you're going to get some pretty decent puzzles i think they've been okay i've got to say most of the puzzles that i've encountered granted i i edit most of that experience out just because like a whole lot of people don't want to see me just struggle and get mad but most of the puzzles that i've seen aren't um slowing down gameplay for me that much right like there's some some games that like pride themselves on making your playthroughs like agonizingly slow just because the puzzles want to be really difficult. I'm trying to get a better 
a better view of this. Um, but I feel like these puzzles are appropriate in the difficulty and they don't really take away from the point of the game, which is to like experience a fantastic story, you know? Uh, stuff like that, I always feel like is, is big props to those sorts of games. Like, don't get me wrong, those difficult puzzle games, they have their place and I'm not shitting on them by any means. Um, but, st but, but puzzle games and stories that don't take away from the story itself, like, that's a really difficult balance. I feel like, um, this is one of those games that's really doing it pretty well. Running on these blades that were just spinning. A little unnerving. Get off that. Handgun ammo. Yay, we take that. We take all ammunitions. There's nothing else in this room. About up there. No. Oh. Shoddy out. Shoddy out. Man, what, what wants to kill me now, man? Factory map. Okay, we've got a new map up to these higher levels. So that's good. Got this cart here. I'm doing something with. I'm not exactly sure what. Oh, there's a thing behind it. Okay. I'm going to go upstairs before I climb into that little um, hidey hole to induce the, uh, the tightness phobia. My wife has really bad pho I can't remember what it's called. Oh, God. What is this? No! All right. Glad I floated slowly enough to where my bad aim could actually mean something. Oh, no! Holy cow, bro. And just like that, our adventure could have ended. That was close. No joke. I feel like I want to go backwards now and go through that hidey hole, though. I feel like that was the way to go first. Dang it, man. I don't know if I can. Uh, we'll just keep going forward, bro. Keep moving forward. This is a train wreck. Do I jump? Oh, here's this. Okay. Good thing I didn't jump. I know Ethan's a bit of an athlete. I don't know if he was going to make that jump. A ladder? Mm hmm. Interesting. All all the level designs have been really, really good. Give it a spinner. Give it a spinner, Ruski. All right. Yeah, all the level designs are always really good. Like Resident Evil games, they always do a good job. I'm just going to push buttons. No. They always do a good job of like offering you up the entirety of the map in the Soon, beginning. She'll start her ceremony with your rose. Bitch. If that happens, it's all over. For your kid. And for the whole village. But don't worry. I'll stop it. I'll use Rose to kill Miranda. <laughs> Poor Papa. You're the only one who doesn't see your kid's power. Take Rose? <laughs> I'd like to see you try. Talk your shit, Ethan. Look, I, I gotta say, I'm not against using Rose to, like, you know, to get out of this situation. Because, like, if that's, like, just what it is, it's gotta be what it is. But, that said, I'm also not interested in compromising my daughter's safety so if those two go hand in hand then the answer of course is no right but if she's good to go and we can use your power and she can survive to get up out of here that might be a that might be a winner decision that might be a big brain move for us i think we should consider there's more more what more what ethan what do you see that i don't see dude He, he makes me nervous, like, what are you talking about? Um, the fuck is this, dude? Okay. So I guess we got to go back. Uh, we got to go back to that, to that key molding area and then come all the way back here and we're on B something. 
be three or something. Be one. Come on now. Usually these are like weird time trials. All the elevator gets up and the enemies pop out and you gotta fight them. Fight them and hold them back till the elevator gets there. Oh, okay. I forget Duke is on the elevator. Okay, let's go back. Um, so we're on B1. Let's go all the way down to B4. I think B4 is that room where the uh, they, they have the key molder or the the cog molder, whatever you, whatever it is you want to call it. Oh, since we're here with Duke anyway, right? Can I activate while this is moving? I guess not. But we we ended up getting all of those things to sell, so we may as well sell them. See what comes of it, right? See how much money we get. What up, Duke? What up, Dukey? Two, get that. Oh, there's three of these. Two of these. I'm not interested in selling those just yet. I want to see if there's if they have any utility. Mm -hmm. 65k, and we did notice. Oh wow, we can get more power out of the out of the sniper rifle. That might be this the move is all for now. Investment, even. But we did notice that there was some of this. That Magnum is looking pretty sexy, isn't it? I mean, that's massive sex appeal for a gun. I think this is new. What is this? Customizable part for a handgun greatly reduces recoil. I'm not interested. Uh, special Magnum increases Magnum. I think I'm gonna save up for that Magnum. I don't know why, but I just I kind of want it, dude. To seeing the fruits of your exploration. Cool, dude. All right, let's go back in here. I don't remember. Thank you, Ethan, for the <laughs> the obvious commentary, Captain Obvious. It's dark. I don't remember it being dark though down here. I don't remember that at all. Did they make me come down here and revisit this in like super scary dark mode? After I said earlier that um, this wasn't. Look at that, buddy. Look at that, buddy. Have some, bud. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, you thought that shit was sweet. Lay your ass down. More stuff for Duke. Um, I think we I think we go downstairs. I'm not sure. Just generally not sure. I don't remember the way. I gotta be honest with y'all. I just don't remember it. Especially with everything being dark now, it's like kinda hard to make out. Ah! No. No, you bastard. Eat it. Yeah, we hit hard, baby. Let's go. We're going to get a little healy heal. He, he did shank me right there, and that wasn't great. But that healy juice is it's good for everything. All right, this is where we want to be. We're going to craft this key, uh, key mold. For the horsey door on B B1. That top shit. That top level. Hopefully you guys are enjoying, man. Guys, please remember to smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Maybe comment something down below. Comment your favorite part of the entire series up to this point. Heisenberg's key. That's a that's a big boy. That's a big boy pull right there. Alright, so we're just gonna go back the way we came. Keep it simple, stupid. It's my my life motto. Keep it simple, stupid. Mm. Okay, we got another one trying to rev up his little engine on us. Oh, boy. Okay, that's... Some bum. Open up. Open up for daddy. Yes, sir. Oh my god. Run. Open up. How many bullets? Okay, healy, healy, healy.
Yes, sir. Perfect crystal mechanical heart. Yo, this is getting weirder and weirder with like these weird uh, zombie machine combo abominations that we keep having to deal with. Not great, not great at all. Uh, this way, maybe? Wow, that's really dark. Love this. Oh, yes. You've gotta be absolutely shitting me right now. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna get a couple of those and some shoddy ammo. <sighs> this is incredible right now. Um, let's do this. And then we're gonna grab the pipe bomb and we're just gonna chuck that sucker. Yeah. I think I'm just done with the bullshit. Like this is this is so over the top. These zombie T2s. Dang it. Come on, man. That's it, buddy. Hey, that was a pretty decent use of resources, right? Knock the armor off, pull the sniper, and then rock his shit a little bit more. Love it. I think this is it, right? Yes, there he is. Cool. Let's revisit our boy Duke. Uh, sell some of these yeah, biddies. Yes. The Duke's Purse. 3,500. 10,000. 50k. All right. And buy it, I hey, will. I think we have enough for the, for the, no the big boy Magnum here. Yes, sir. Okay. Boom. Why not? Let's see what this is about, shall we? Next we meet. Um, let's move some things around. Some things around, move that up here. That here, and then let's equip that. But I wanna quick slot it to, um, to shortcut it up towards where the, I mean, it uses different ammunition then look at this thing man this is so old school looking i can't wait to use this on something let's go blow something's head off all right up to b1 man we're making pretty pretty good run through here pretty good run through pretty good run through i like the little um the symbols on it you know what it reminds me of is if you guys ever played red dead redemption 2 with my homie Arthur and Morgan, you could go to the gunsmith and get like these markings on on uh, these pistols and stuff. That stuff was always pretty dope. So it kind of reminds me of that. Let's save it real quick. And here we are. We've got what we need. See behind door number one. All right, buddy. No more surprises, Heisenberg. You unlocked it. You really sure are did. a tough one. I am. But I'm yes. tired, chit -chat. Time to die. You're shitting me? Can't you? Someone waiting for you. Someone's waiting for me. That's the fanboy. He's the fanboy. Use a cheap turboprop engine, but he's impossible to control. All he does is charge. Too much power output from the reactor. Completely invincible head on. But the dumbass managed to chop his own damn arms off on the propeller. Also, issues. With overheating from running for a long periods of time. Conclusion, a complete failure. Okay, so don't be in front of the thing. And there's a good chance if we go at it too long, he'll just fucking fall over because he can't stand up to too long. Okay, yeah, see the pistol and the magnum ammo are completely separate, so. More handgun, okay. Take what I can get, man. All right, buddy boys, let's do it, man. We got a boss battle. Anything else? No. You hear him stomping around, revving up his little life. I don't have time for this bullshit. Out of my way. I don't understand. 
piece literally, bro. Okay, hold on, hold on. I think... Oh yeah, on fire. Look at him, look at him, he has no clue. Oh my gosh. Oh man. I can't get behind him again. I don't know where he is, I can't see him. That's big power. Big power from the Big Daddy Magnum. Oh, no! Ah! No, get back! The Healy Juice! We gotta go through this. Oh, my God. Okay, hold on, hold on, boys. We're gonna have to... Cra I can't crab tell. Oh, no, no. Oh boy. That was my chance, but he hid back here to do that shit, man. Reload. Now stay down. Stay down, bum. Get up behind you. Okay, is that it? Oh! Complex mechanical heart! First time, baby. Let's go. That feels good. That feels really good. Hey, the Magnum. Yo, that the Magnum is like... Is a thicky boy fucking gun, isn't it? Let's see here. I don't even remember where we came in from. Heisenberg's gonna be upset that his fanboy didn't do the job. Um, let me see. Something here, yo. A cigar. The hell? Miranda is abominable. Her deceit knows no bound. Only really a bunch of failed to do experiments to her. I was lucky enough to have any of the stuff in the other poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. This crazy bitch has never been right in the head. Can't see the difference between experiment and family. She took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be on my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. and turn into anyone using the Megam site. Trick that the trick is that brat Rose. If I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of the kid's dad, Ethan has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. This guy's been checking out my body this whole time. He's an absolute perv. He's a pervy boy. No thanks. No thanks, bud. All right, man. Let's see here. Herb. The metal scraps. You know we're gonna break this sucker. Hold on, I, I need to equip my knife because I unequipped that. Chem fluids. Cool. Let's ride. Oh, I can't do that down here. Ugh. What's in here? More shoddy ammo. Yes. Big win. It feels like I should be able to go through here, but I guess I guess not. All right, we'll crawl back. We will crawl back. That's fine. All right, head into here. I think the place is looking more and more ominous as I continue to look at it. Wonder if we're gonna have to fight Heisenberg here, or if we're gonna end up teaming up with him. I mean, he's been looking at my body. That's not great, but did I hear a roar? I heard a little, maybe it was like more of like a purr? I don't know. Break. I wish I could craft magnum bullets. I should have looked into that with Duke before I came out here. I didn't realize how much I was going to like this heavy hitter. This Rick Grimes. Ooh. Here we go. Ah. Let's do it, Ethan. Let's do it, Ethan. Yes, sir. Okay, doors. I, you guys know me. I just want to make sure we're not missing resources. Since I'm, since I like over waste them, you, you know, you gotta look for them a little bit more. 
Okay, this... I'm getting a weird vibe out of this room. Random tractor. Okay. Okay, bud. Here we go. What the... That's not not bad. Not bad, Jersey. You're persistent. But I've got a rebellion. Too. So stay out of my way. I'm not shooting, by the way. What the heck? Gosh, man. Thank God there's some water down there. Sheesh. That bastard. This bastard boy. Well, that wasn't great. Again? Obviously, could have been better. We can go through there. I guess that's the only way to go. Uh, they're really kind of milking this area, which I don't love. You know, I talked about level design. Two steps forward, one step back. I just thought that was bass, bass fight. I thought that was boss fight time, you know? It's kind of crazy. Heisenberg is basically Magneto from X-Men. <laughs> what is that? No! Damn it, Chris! Stop doing that! I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. You are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. I guess I owe you an explanation. Yeah. Please. Give me that wrench. No, he's gonna whack us with it. Don't give him a weapon. What the heck? Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. That might not be true. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get anything. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. Okay. I will stay down here and finish planting explosives. You take that elevator, I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Okay, Together. Chris. Okay. Damn straight we will. And when I find Miranda... She's a dead woman. Look at his All face. Right. He's like, that's cute. And you take this and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. With that thing? You want me to stealth mission with that? Th do you hear it? You can't turn back now. Do you hear the thing? All right.
Okay, thought I heard something. I couldn't tell if that was the game or my my room. <laughs> Ugh. It's a price you pay when you play in the dark. Okay. Sweeping the factory is complete. Managed to get my hands on her document. Infected herself to grant her a number of abilities, including mimic, mimic, mimicry. Control her cells and transform herself into anything. Disguise herself as Mia. That was fucked, bro. When we attacked, it put a little damper on her plans. So she mimicked a corpse. Revived herself in the transport truck, held everyone aboard, and took off with Rose. So that was the beginning when we when we jumped up from the ground and everybody around us was dead. Okay. It's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found myself something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around. Time to turn the tables. Yes, sir. All right. All right, boys. Here we go. Off to go save the daughter. Apparently with Metal Chris Redfield's help. Huh? Time to fight fire with fire. <clears throat> we'll say it would have been better had Chris just been open and transparent in the beginning. We basically had to like prove ourselves. Okay, so this is cannon ready, fire cannon. Okay. That's our guard is the left bumper. All right, let's ride, boys. Heisenberg is going to be like, what the hell? It came back with a mech suit. <laughs> yeah, I'm basically Iron Man now. So that's pretty cool. Let's do it, baby. Let's do it. I'm actually, this is like kind of getting me hype, you know. I'm kind of hype, boys. Uh, uh, uh. Infinite ammo, Iron Man. Some of this chainsaw, I do. All right. He said, be discreet. <laughs> Big bottom thing. Oh, shit. Yeah, buddy. This will be my before I kill the bitch. Let's see. Have that. Your curse will be another addition to my armor. Block it. Let's go. You guys see weak points anywhere? Oh, these the the orange. Okay, I see the orange. Got it. Oh, oh boy. I'm trying to get this little spot. Is he gonna blow these outward? Blocking. Oh shit. I wish I, I can't move fast. There's no like boosters or anything like that. Have it. Oh boy. Blocking. I'm blocking. Blocking again. I know, I know, I'm in a mech suit, so that makes me pretty strong. Let's go! Have some dude. Let's go! I'm just trying to hit the orange parts. Hopefully that's the idea here. Got him! Got him! I, mi I missed so bad. You guys don't talk about my aim, okay? Let's go! What a block! Don't say that, dude. Touch this! Don't need to dodge, buddy. 
Just things up, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Thank God things got so many bullets. <laughs> oh! I need some of my Healy Potion juice. Is he down? Probably not. I just want to keep shooting. I don't even want to see. <laughs> just in case. Yes, sir! You hear him powering up? He's trying to go Goku! Ah. Oh my gosh. No, my mech suit! Yes, sir! Uh, put that, uh, craft bullets for it real quick. Come on. Why am I so slow? Too bad I'm your only fan. Final stretch. Okay. Let me get some of this. Maybe a sniper? Maybe a sniper's a good shot right here. Come on. Fire. Let's go! Oh, no. I thought that was it. He's still coming. I have nowhere to hide, bro. I have nowhere to hide, dude. Oh, he's got me. Oh, don't tell me I messed up. You really should have taken my deal. You'll be foiled in the afterlife. Man, this is jacked. Groovy's power is one. We're back. We're back in the mech. This can't be the end for me! It is. It's over for you, buddy. Must kill her. Later. Let's go. Crystal Heisenberg. That was super satisfying. Iron Giant down. Ethan? I heard explosions. What the hell happened? Nothing. I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Hang up on him. Wait there, you hear me? Ethan? Rose? Ethan! Ethan, respond! Oh! Oh Mia? shit. Not Mia. A child. She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg on, you've lost your lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. <clears throat> You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> oh, <my. laughs> Miranda. Enough. Bitch. Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have her. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! Well said, Ethan. Calm yourself. Rose will be saved. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. <laughs> 
She's my child, not yours. Where are you? Show yourself. Do Why it. did Rose come to be? Was it because of her parents? Oh, and man. you are truly a special case. But I've learned all I can from you. Your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda! You coward! Come on and face me! No! Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Megamycetes records. Is that my heart? I'll make sure to sample your blood for later. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. Ah! <laughs> I'm shook. I think that I think that chick just grabbed my heart. But dreams really can come true. Best or not, I can't wait to see my true child again. Yo, I just got absolutely clapped right there. Oh my god. Absolutely clapped. Uncool. Captain, I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not gonna get away with it dude god damn it when does it end it doesn't that, Chris. the mission all of it three years trying to put this thing in the ground three years too long What a badass. So BSAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. <clears throat> Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. okay. K-9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. Been a while since we fought together, Oh, Captain. we get to be Chris. When was the last? The desert? All right. So I don't know how long this is going to be. Um, if it's not too long, I'll continue it in this episode. If it is, then I will cut it and make a separate episode out of it. So just full transparency. Well.